Hey, what's up you guys, it's Connor, and today I am here with Nanook. Am I here with you, puppy? Why are you out of breath? And today we're gonna be doing our pet treater unboxing. For some reason, it has come in a very different shaped box. I don't know what happened to the green box. If you guys don't know, Pet Treater is a monthly subscription service that sends you treats and toys and goodies for your pup and also yourself. You get a treat of your own. It's called the Pet Treater for your human. And this box starts off at $26, I believe. I'm not sure on that. And then it gets cheaper from there if you get a longer subscription period. All the treats are made in the US, so good quality. Are you bored? They come in small, medium, and large. Nook gets the large because he's over 50 pounds. You look so tired right now. Why are you so tired? Will you give me a high five? High five. You are so lazy. But I love you. I love you, puppy. So let's just get started. And the other pups have decided to join in. So when you open the box, this is what it looks like. On the front, is a little letter to your dog. This is how you spell Nanook. And then on here it says, Rut Row Raggy. We ran short on our usual pet treater boxes this month, so yours arrived in this different box. Don't worry, it's the same great stuff. We just didn't want to keep your pup waiting. Mwah. So inside the letter, Guten Tag, good day. Oh, I forgot. This month is going to be Barktoberfest themed. My name is, I don't even know how to say that. <laughs> it's like the human version of Oktoberfest, only so much better. This is a fun parade full of my doggy friends in their finest German attire. We all bark out our favorite polka songs and do our best yodel to earn treats. And then it also talks about how Pet Treater donates beds, blankets, and toys to shelter dogs and cats while they're waiting for their forever homes. So the first thing I see in here is actually gonna be the Pet Treater for your human, and that is going to be this silicone pumpkin-shaped cupcake muffin pan with silicone pumpkins. So, oh my gosh, Rock, get out of here. So it comes with a little silicone pumpkin utensil. I don't know what these things are called. And then it also comes with these silicone muffin trays. And on the back, it has different pumpkin faces. And they're not all the same, which is super fun. And I've actually been using the silicone pet molds that I have a lot. So maybe I'll make some dog-friendly muffins for you, puppy. Is that what you want? Leave it. They also sent another HelloFresh coupon. If you guys don't know what this is, it's a weekly subscription service and they send you a certain number of meals per week and they're all fresh and they're all healthy and, and they send you everything that you need and the recipes. I've done this before, but recently they have not been packaging it very well and stuff will leak and we have to throw it out because you obviously can't eat anything that has touched raw chicken juice all over the place and everything. So I probably won't be using this because I'm done using HelloFresh, so whoops. I also sent a little card and this pet of the month is going to be Cosmo. It looks like a little miniature poodle. And on the back it has some dog friendly beer, which I think is in here, yes! So there's some Bowser beer, Porky Pup Porter. And this is a non-alcoholic beer for dogs. So next time I'm partying, do you wanna party with me? This is also made in the USA, so you don't have to worry about that. And after you open it, you'll have to refrigerate it, but this is awesome. And it's pork flavored, so. You wanna hold it? Here. You hold that, don't move. The next thing in here is going to be this alien toy. <laughs> oh, oh, Nook. Okay, that's not how you do that. <laughs> it's gonna be Monster's Dog Toy Chew Resistant Material. There's a squeaker inside, I think, somewhere. Oh, there they are. They're on the little tentacles, so that's fun. This is just like plushy. There's no squeaker in this, but that's awesome. You guys wanna try it out? I always cut off the tags of these because they try to chew them off and that stops them from ruining the toys as quickly. Rock, do you want it? Rock got it. The next thing in here is going to be this breast cancer awareness bone. It has the little symbol in the corner there. And Nook used to have a bone like this, a plush bone, and he loved it. He used to use it as a pillow. See, let's stop. But there's no squeaker in this, so that's good. Do you want to try this, Nook? Here you go. You want it? Oh my gosh. All right, so this is what Sila has been trying to get at inside the box. The next thing in here is going to be this beef knuckle. This is an all-natural treat for a dog. It's made in the U.S. <laughs> it's huge, and it smells really strong. I don't know if 
I'm gonna give this to them or not? Stop. Oh my gosh, guys. They obviously really want it, but I've heard you're not really supposed to give dogs load-bearing bones because it can chip their teeth. So I'll just have to do a little bit more research on this one as well as I wouldn't give it to them in this video anyway. So I may give this to them while we're watching TV or something like that, but for now, it's just a tease. <laughs> the next thing in here are going to be these smokehouse chicken strips. Oh, this one's chicken and this one's bacon. They're vacuum sealed. They're made in the US. They're by Indigo. And we've had something like this before. And when you open them, you have to use them within a certain amount of time. So I'm not gonna open them right now, but these pups love these things. So that's really, really exciting. I like these a lot. Yes! <laughs> There's the bandana. So on this one it says drinking buddy on it. Nikki, are you gonna be my drinking buddy? You look so handsome, being my drinking buddy. Here you go. How's it look? I love you in bandanas, puppy. You are too freaking cute. And the last thing that's gonna be in this box is going to be this over the door pet organizer so you can organize different toys and such. That's pretty neat because we've gotten a lot of toys recently and you can just hang it on top of the door. And they also have a place where you can put a picture of your pup at the top of it. If you can see that, there's a picture of the dog and it has different sections and you can put different things in them. So that's really exciting. I'm gonna be using that definitely to put all of Nook's different things. I think I'll probably use one section for all his bandanas because he has so many and he's so cute in all of them. Aren't you, puppy? Give me a kiss. <gasps> he doesn't love me. I kiss you instead. Because we didn't show any of the treats being used, I'm actually gonna open this right now and I'm gonna give them the treats because why not? Ready, puppy? Oh, they smell. Ready? Pause up. Good boy. Rock? Sila? Good girl. So now that's gonna be everything that's in the pet treater unboxing for October. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and comment down below what your favorite type of beer is. Have you ever tried the dog safe beer? I wonder how your dogs have liked it. And we will talk to you guys next time. Bye. Say bye guys. Rock. Ooh. Ooh.